All right, sweetie, what would you say are your top three requirements for our new home? Um, one would be a updated electrical infrastructure mm. in the house, mm -hmm. for sure. Um, with the hobby equipment that both of us have, um, with the power that they draw, I mean, we don't want breakers popping all over the place and yeah, stuff true. turning off. I mean, you know, true. so we, 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 we can't have that. Yeah, been there, done that. Dedicated hobby space. Mm -hmm. So when I'm painting or, or cutting stuff or breaking in an engine or something like that for my RC hobby, um, that it would be a little bit outside the house so that, mm -hmm. that we could, you know, it wouldn't disturb the family or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> and let's see, third, probably um, walking distance to some convenience stores um, access. Um, okay. And then being close enough to, since we do have our vehicle, um, to drive to the grocery store not too far away. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. So how about you? What do you I would like to have a dedicated hobby space too. Okay. Um, because we did come here with the full-fledged desire and wish that we would be able to enjoy our hobbies yeah. and whatnot. So I would, so we, that's one of the main reasons we kept my embroidery machine, my, um, my cutter, my heat press, my hat press, all of the things that I use to embellish and decorate um, clothes. And, you know, I would like to keep that and do that. So I would like to have a dedicated hobby space. Sure. Um, next up behind that would probably be, oh, a guest space for the family. Sure. Yeah. I, I mean, mean, we are <sighs> aspiring empty nesters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but every now and then I would like the kids to, the kids to be able to come back from college and and maybe for us to be together at Christmas time or yeah, sure. for family to come and visit and I'd like for them to have, um, or at least the space be able to accommodate, you know, some room for family to come visit. Sure, yeah, yeah, absolutely. And then my last thing would probably be a rooftop garden. Yeah, you've always wanted one of those. A little sexy rooftop garden situation, you know, <laughs> so that we could have a fantastic view. That would be just the icing on the cake. Yeah, so, that sounds good. Sounds good. So if we can look for those, uh, <laughs> find the house with all those things, then yeah, <sighs> write it up. Yeah. Search begins. All right, so let's go get something to eat. Okay.
what y'all think about that house? Yes. Um, what do you think about that house? Nice space. Let, let's put it that way. It's it's a nice house. Um, it has the amount of space that we need for the hobby. Right. For sure. Yeah, for sure. Um, the, the, the bungalow, as she called it, or the casita, uh-huh. has two large bedrooms. Right. It, which is... Perfect. Perfect for working space. That was a separation yeah. of the the working space. And actually, from... for for me, it would double as my hobby space and office mm-hmm. because it's a large, large space. Yeah. Um. And so, and, and it may be the same for Angela. Yeah. Yeah. Because it it, it's a no. Large... It's not just have enough space for my books um, to be in there in the same room, but the house, it overall has lots of space yeah. for that kind of thing. It's on a busy street, though. Yes, it's on a busy street. Very busy. Um, uh, that was grapes. Uh, yes. Grapes and mangoes. Okay, yeah. go yeah. there, get your bags up. Yeah. But yeah, the um, the kitchen was was nice. Right. The kitchen was nice. Had lots of nice space in it. And she said that the location is ideal. Because it is perfect, perfectly located to all the things, right. all the things. Right. And as we are leaving the neighborhood or leaving the road, I can see why she would say that. Because yeah, this is definitely space for all the things. Yes. Um, it. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to deal with the busy road. Like it's busy all night, all day. Yeah, the, the noise, the noise, the road noise. Yes. Yeah. Um, yeah. The space is great. The house needs a great deal. Actually, it needs some updating. It, it definitely the floor um, in the home. Um, yeah, I wasn't a fan of the laminate floors. Right. I wasn't a fan. Yeah. Um, and I wasn't a fan now they as as you heard them mention that they previously were using the house as an office, office yes um, they had 25 30 people so in there, they had said. a lot of employees working there in that building in the space so and the fact that it could uh, handle that level of internet power and all that kind of stuff is promising this it really is central to everything five minutes and you're at the grocery store home depot is right down here home depot all the things denny's denny's starbucks fitness center all the things are over here so that is nice that is very nice yeah, so we, we have uh, some appointments this afternoon, evening, to look at some homes. Um, and I, um, so is this house in the running? I'm trying to grow in this because from an aesthetic standpoint, um, there are things that I find not appealing, uh, but I'm, I'm trying to, to, I guess some people would overlook that and see something different about the home. I, I'm just I'm, I'm, I'm struggling with the fact that um, the floor, the, the how they painted, how things were set up. Um, I'm very much a technical person, so um, the internet connectivity is in the master bedroom. Um, I would have to figure out how to redirect all of that equipment to a closet that's right below the master bedroom, which would be a more, uh, a, a better space for that equipment instead of being in the master bedroom. They had shelving in there and everything. So it would be a better place to um, house all of the internet to run all of the stuff from. Um, the master bedroom is kind of like a two level deal. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, look, they had that sitting, sitting space, space in front of um, the right and the where the bed would probably be. And views wasn't out. enough closet space for me in this house, right? Um, in terms of the master, um, it was 
one closet that was would be shared, right. which wouldn't necessarily work for your girl. Yeah. But um, okay, so but I think that this should be in the running. Yeah. Just by virtue of the space. Now yeah, we now, live with the being on the road and hearing the noise from the uh, hearing the noise from the traffic traffic and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm not a fan. Um, but the space definitely wasn't was now if we come in cut in visit a home that has that same space but is a little bit more updated then that one will pop to the top of the, the, the list. So the search continues. Yes. Alright, All right. so our apt, our appointments have been pushed to this afternoon. Uh, so we've got a break. We're going to run back to our Airbnb and take a break and check in with the kids and uh, we'll be back later on this afternoon. Yep. Alright. All right. Bye guys. Bye. Thank you.